2K Sports and the PGA Tour. Proud to bring you the season-long race for the FedEx Cup. We're at the John Deere Classic. Today's coverage is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this second round action. I'm Luke Elvey with Rich Beam here as we keep an eye on this player who's been trailing in the tournament but has a real opportunity today. They do. They need to get out there, though, and start firing at some flags. They've been playing very conservative all week long, and you can't continue to do that with any hopes of winning. You have to go ahead and start trying to take advantage of the conditions. Hit it close a few more times. And until they start doing that, I don't see them uh, catching the leaders. Can't wait to see how today's play plays out. Time to get to the action. Let's see what kind of tone he sets for himself today. You liked that, didn't you? Second shot here on the first. Well played, mate. This part of about seven feet to the hole. Well, that's a lovely way to get going. They've already started this event under par. I've never been disappointed by starting off my round with a birdie, Luke, I can tell you that. He's in a share of third place. Let's see what happens here on the second hole. You want to cut the corner as much as possible to shorten your second shot on this par five. Should you do that, a very straightforward second shot will set up birdies and eagles all day long. Find the trouble off the tee and you'll find trouble on the rest of the hole. Don't fool yourself. Oh, well played. Penny, what have they got in front of them here? Setting up here from about 195 yards. Looks to have chosen the 7-iron. Well, take notes, folks. That's how you do it. Would it be nice to make this putt? This is for Eagle. And down it goes. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. She's currently trailing her rival. Let's see what happens here. Oh, I thought that one was going in. Let's take a look at the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the third hole. Par three, 183 yards up the hill, blind tee shot. The big miss here is short right in that deep bunker. Should you find that bunker, you're also gonna find yourself making bogey or worse. Anywhere on the green is a good shot. Going with the six iron here. Oh, terrific approach and a chance for birdie here at the third. Oh, just missed. And that should secure the par on this one. He currently sits in third position. Now on the tee of a long par four. Par four, 448 yards, sweeping dog leg left to right, big tree in the middle, miss that, and you've got a simple second shot into a sliver of a green. Handy effort, that one. Playing this shot from 120 yards. 
Five shots off the lead. Opting for the nine iron. Oh, what a lovely shot. He'll be delighted to be inside the range there. Henny, you've had the chance to have a look over this one? Setting up this part 14 feet from the cup. Surely it's going to. What do we catch up with Brooke Henderson? She got one back on that last hole. Let's see if we can make this big putt for birdie. Big chance here. Yeah, that's lovely weight. Getting it right up by the hole. Excellent job. Our leader is up by four shots now. We've arrived at a par four hole. Par four, this fairway chases away from the players down the hill, so tee shots will run forever, setting up a second shot that is very simple and straightforward. That's some good golf right there. And Henny, what kind of a shot are they facing this time? And from around 135 yards, yeah, that's a good line. That should find the surface. Wow, very aggressive play on this approach, putting some pressure on their rival, Brooke Henderson. An opportunity for a birdie here. This is on a great line. Ooh, a couple of birdies on the bounce. Look who's on a roll. Gotta like it. Two in a row. Now three strokes back after that hole. Here we find ourselves on the tee of a par four. Par four measures just 361 yards, but only the long players will try and drive this green. The others, lay it up with an iron, wedge it on, hit it close, make your birdie. Pretty good shot there. Second shot here on the sixth. Well, you're a ball striker. There's no doubt about that. Another green in regulation. This is an absolute clinic. Now, this is a challenging one. A lengthy putt awaits. Get the fist pump ready. This looks like it's going in. Nice putt to make that one. Give yourselves a pat on the back. Oh, yeah, that's huge. Oh, that celebration, that's a little spicy. I don't know if these two are going to be talking now. And with that, that's their fourth birdie. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard after that effort. Let's see what happens here on the seventh. Par three down the hill. It seemingly plays short, but I can promise you it doesn't. Going with the five iron here. It's fair to say that that approach didn't hit the mark. A bit short with that effort. And he needs this to save par. On a nice line. Solid par putt, that. Our leader is a couple of shots up at this stage.
And now we find ourselves with a par four here. Par four, every single shot plays uphill. Make sure to take plenty of club. What kind of shot are they facing here, Henny? This is looking around 115 yards out. Going with the 9-iron, I think. The wind was howling, but that didn't matter. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. Yeah, she's down, she's behind, her rivals scooting ahead. Let's see what happens. Mm -mm. Handy out of the bunker there. OK, let's get back to it, shall we? Just putt right on 10 feet, a good one to make. It's on a great line. Well done. Take the birdie. Just one off the lead after that hole. Teeing off here at the ninth hole. Par four, 485 yards, the toughest hole on the golf course. Make sure you find the fairway and get your second shot somewhere around the green to give yourself the best chance of making four. Out a boy. Good shot. This is the second shot here on the ninth hole. Choosing the nine iron here. Club up. I like this play. That's tidy. And this punt for a share of the lead. This one's tracking. And that part will give them birdie number six on the day. That's a momentum maker, isn't it? Back-to-back -back birdies move in the right direction there, Luke. And just with nine holes remaining, Rich, what do you think here is going to happen for this player? Well, after nine, so far, so good. It's great to see these two players stepping up, getting the best out of the games, It'll be interesting to see exactly who's going to be ahead at the end of the tournament. That dog will hunt. Second shot here on the 10th hole. Going with the hybrid. Needs this one to kick right. Well, that's certainly showcasing all their talents there. That's impressive. Using all of his muscles to get that one home in two. Here's Brooke Henderson's next shot. 
And there it goes from the sand. What are we looking at for this part, Henny? He's got to be careful this doesn't get away from him here. This is downhill. It's tracking. Oh, sensational putt, that one. A big play at the right time, and their rival is now shaking in their boots. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. I'm pretty sure this player will be full of confidence now after that eagle back at the last hole. Par four, 428 yard, tree line hole, difficult driving hole all the way around, but should you find the fairway, the second shot on a little plateau just above the fairway is very basic. Not bad. Playing from around 160 yards. He's got a two stroke buffer. And choosing the eight iron here. Oops, this one's headed for the rough. Didn't quite strike that as cleanly as they would have hoped. Oh, look at that. The wind just wreaking havoc with that shot. Disappointing. Well, they've found the bunker, but a chance to maybe save from there. That takes great skill. Lovely shot out of the sand. And back to the course with the live action. Getting ready to play their third. Wow, that almost went in the hole. Just six feet between here and the hole. This is what they have left for par here. Yep, tracking nicely. That gets the job done. Now two shots up after that one. Let's head to the 12th hole. Par three plays 208 yards from the back. In saying that, this is a good birdie opportunity as the green is massive in size. to be going with the five iron. Yeah. Outstanding shot, high quality. Be nice to see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. Go on, get in the hole. Oh, you're going to be hard to catch now if you keep making putts like that. Managing to maintain their position on the leaderboard. Teeing off here on the 13th hole. Par four, back up the hill, 418 yards, the widest fairway on the golf course. Avoid all those bunkers. Second shot up the hill to a narrow green that slopes off on both sides. And that's a nice strike. This one should find the fairway. And what are we looking at here, Henny? This is down breeze, so it's going to be tough to stop it on this green. Oh, that's a great shot and sets up a birdie look here at the 13th. Oh, that lie ain't pretty. She's got lots of work to get out of this bunker. It looks like they have a bad lie here in the sand. What a... Oh, that's clutch. What a way to save your par. 
And now this is why you can never get comfortable, even if you're leading a PGA Tour Pro. This is what they do. They mean business. Super shot that. Two in a row there, Luke, getting their groove on. He sits in first position. And they'd be feeling buoyed with confidence after that birdie. Here's a good chance to maintain the momentum. Par four, 357 yards. Almost every player in the field will be giving it a whirl. Knock it on, and you could be rewarded with an eagle two. Time for the second shot at the 14th. How close was that to going down? And Henny, what are they looking at here? Yeah, they've left it in the perfect spot here, just below the hole. They can be aggressive up the hill. This really looks good. All right, you'll make it the next time. And down it goes. Leading by four strokes after that one. Time to step on your tee shot here at this long par four. Not a bad drive, a little bit shorter than Beamer, not bad. And Henny, what's he looking at here? Yeah, he's got a round 125 here. Well, this one's going right at the flag. Yeah, that was tricky with that wind. Great shot there. Why don't we catch up with Brooke Henderson? She's trying to pull ahead in this group rivalry. Let's see what happens. Oh, Rich, how good is that? I got to say, I thought soccer players flopped awfully well. This one was way better than that. Putting for birdie here. Well, that'll play. And still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Stepping up to the 16th tee now. Par three only plays 153, but a tricky little green to say the least. Don't let the beauty of the river to your left swallow you in. This is a tough but fun little par three. Good shot there. And now over to Brooke Henderson's next shot. She's got momentum now, just birdied the last hole. Oh, wow, Rich, how good was that? Nothing like it. Good stuff. What's in front of them, Henny? He's staring down 23 feet here. All right, guys, this for two birdies in a row.
Okay, steady now. Oh, what a shame. That would have been a nice one to hold. Just three feet to the cup. Our current leader is up by three shots. Now at the 17th hole. Players looking for a fast finish on the par five, 550 yards. Second shot does play up the hill, but there's plenty of room to miss your second shot around this green. Must make birdie for the players in the field. Wonderfully played. Playing this shot from about 230 yards out. Wind is blowing from right to left here. Wants to work it against the wind. That's well played. Anything on the green from there was fine. So exciting to have an eagle putt here. Come on, ball. Don't deny him. Ooh, right by the hole. Our leader is currently enjoying a four-stroke advantage. A long par four this hole. Hard to describe the difficulty of this tee shot unless you've actually been here. Par four, 463 yards. Missed the fairway bunker down the right-hand side, and you've got a clear shot to a very narrow green surrounded by water on the left-hand side. And that's not ideal. Finding the trees. And he's down there. I can see the 125 yard marker just nearby. Going with the eight iron here. Pay attention, folks. That's how you play golf. Birdie at the last. This for another. This putt's about four feet from the hole. That signs off on this player's performance.